For the benefit of the environment, it is at times necessary to arrange habitats and breeding scenarios. In this captive society, we have introduced a young male to a young female. Upon meeting, the male and female engage in grooming, each attempting to draw the other's attention to his or her best features. Much to the luck of the male, the female becomes intrigued and, after a short test of aggression, the female asserts herself. In a captive setting, it is difficult to conduct healthy mating and breeding. The fence or barrier may initially trigger a sense of anxiety in the congregation. But with time, the knowledge of the fence fades from the minds of the habitat members and a level of comfort is achieved. A couple has now grown accustomed to one another. Despite the male's attempts at wooing, the female appears unwilling to commit so quickly. But, after some provoking, she accepts. Hopefully our couple will follow the example of the other members of the habitat, raising children and becoming comfortable with their surroundings. Family life in the congregation is peaceful, and if our couple is successful in breeding, they will be gladly welcomed in the community. Fortunately, the willingness of the female has grown, and life continues.